What's up guys, Jake here. Today we're in a shallow canal and we're gonna be searching for possible murder weapons. Now, if this is your first time watching my YouTube videos, that sounds pretty crazy, right? But if you've been watching my videos for a while, you know we've come across like 20 weapons in the past. And in this creek alone, we've actually come across two pistols and parts to an AR. It's a lot of fun searching for weapons, but not only that, it's also very rewarding when you hand a weapon to the police officer because they can use that to help solve some kind of case that you know maybe would not have been solved in the past. So with that said, I've got my beautiful girlfriend joining me on this adventure today and we're gonna be walking up and down this canal. I've also have a trash bag any trash we find along the way we're gonna be sticking in here throwing it at the end just want to leave this place a little bit better than we found it if you enjoy this video and you want to see more like this in the future drop a thumbs up if the support we'll team back up and see what else we could find and with that said we're gonna start walking down this creek to hopefully find some gnarly stuff to share with you guys so Kendall's walking downstream and she found the first thing of the day it's definitely not treasure and I'm definitely not picking it up I'm sure you guys can understand <laughs> leaving that one right where I found it so that was Kendall's first find this is my first find check it out a butter knife so this is definitely a potential murder weapon i'm just kidding <laughs> everything i find is a potential murder weapon i've seen your guys' comments it's funny man so what we're gonna do just like all the other stuff i'm gonna stick it in the bag we'll throw it away at the end of the day but let's keep walking down the street at first glance i thought this was a foam but i think it's actually a drug scale dude <laughs> what do you think you think it is no i don't think it's a foam no that's not a foam that looks that's like a scale a is it M? Oh yeah, it's a scale. Yeah, it's yeah. like a, so we found a scale. It's a drug scale. That's pretty cool. I mean, it could just be a scale for anything. Why does it have to be a drug <laughs> scale? You know. <laughs> just found something else. Looks like a CD player. I think it is. I think it's a really old CD player. Definitely trash, but I'm gonna throw it away at the end of the day for sure. Oh, look at this. We got a tool. <laughs> I'm not too sure what that is, but if you guys know, let me know in the comment section below. It's definitely a tool to something. All right. Looked over at Kendall, and it looked like she just picked up a pistol. <laughs> what is that? Nah, it's a rock. So I'm looking down. I've got some tools here. I'm just going to stick it in the bag. I put it in this bag. Right. I thought she got me, man. I thought she beat me. <laughs> Someone bought a queen mattress for $599. <laughs> What'd you say? Oh, right. It even has a pretty little, it's broken. I don't know why we're finding so many butter knives. <laughs> so we're walking down this canal and this is the first set of waterfalls we have to go down. I've been here before and the water can go up to your neck. Kendall's actually never been here, so it should be interesting to see her go down these things. Pretty deep in all this nasty canal water, but she's a good sport. All right, so so far we haven't found anything super crazy, like a gun or anything like that, obviously, but we're having a great time. Kendall and I, we're trying to pick up as much trash as possible. So far, we got a little bag full collected. We're gonna continue walking down. There's a few more waterfalls just like that one, so it should get interesting. So I was walking ahead of the group a little bit and check out what I found. I found a hatchet. Like this is really potentially a murder weapon. You just never know. Someone could have been running around the streets with this thing and they threw it over in the canal thinking they can get rid of it. but. It also could have been just, you know, someone just throw it over innocently. But I thought it was pretty cool. I'm going to save it. All right, that's like one kind of potential murder weapon down. <laughs> All right, so I have no idea how I'm getting so lucky lately, but I found another wallet. Let's check it out. But it doesn't look like there's anything inside, so I'm not getting too lucky. Most likely, these wallets I've been finding are people who stole them, and they throw it overboard to get rid of them. But if there was any information, I would, of course, give it back to the person who lost it but it's just an old wallet. I'm gonna throw it away. All right, so I'm not gonna show you guys this in full detail because there's a picture and a full name, but this guy's name is James and there's appears to be a mugshot. Innocently, I thought this was maybe from like a hospital, but I showed my girlfriend and she thought maybe it was from like a jail. You know, it, looked like the, it doesn't look like the, the most flattering picture of a guy. So yeah, this could be, you know, maybe on the guy's wrist, he cut it off, maybe he got out of jail or maybe he was doing work or something and he threw it in the river. Oh, I got it. I got it. I understand what happened now. I'm putting two to two together now. He just escaped from jail, threw his wrist thing in the water, and then he used this to hatchet some people. 
and he actually oh oh no hold on, i got it i got it all right so james i got this man i know what you're up to james so he escaped jail all right he cut his little wrist thing off threw it in the water he had this for his weapon of choice he mugged a lady for her wallet and stole all that threw her wallet in there and then got rid of the weapon dude i could be i could be on csi or something i'm freaking great <laughs> All right, so if you guys made it to this point, remember this guy's name is James on here. Leave a comment in the comment section saying, find James. He's an escaped convict, supposedly, <laughs> allegedly. If there's people who didn't make it to this point, they're gonna have no idea what's going on. So type in the comment section, find James, if you made it here. <laughs> what about James? We're gonna find him, man. <laughs> Dude, that should be my next video. Finding James. <laughs> Just kidding. James Bond. Hey, Kendall said she found something, come on. What did you get? Oh, that's so gross. <laughs> she found an umbrella. I found one the other day in the river with treasure, and now today I'm out here with Kendall, and she found one. Oh, that's gross. Oh, no. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's definitely pretty nasty. Open it up. Oh, it smells. Okay. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Got him! <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh, she's like, I'm ready to go home now. <laughs> that was a little on? bit gross. <laughs> Kendall and I just found this cone. It's actually a pretty nice cone. I'm not going to leave it in the creek. I'm actually going to throw it over the fence. We're just so far from getting out that there's no way I'm going to be able to carry this around. So, Or Kendall could put it on her head. No. <laughs> it has leeches on it. Or All I'd right. be totally down. I'm going to throw it over the fence if I can make it. There you go. It looked weak, but you guys gotta remember, I have a bad shoulder. <laughs> All right, let's keep walking. Good job. It's a pink boat. All right, I've got some more cans right here. So these cans, they're right here by the storm drain and this actually comes off from like a road. So if you're dumping your trash on the side of the road, it goes down here in the waterway. So just, you know, be aware. If you see someone doing it, please tell them to stop. But yeah, pick up the trash. So we've got Tristan on FaceTime. What's up, Tristan? What's up? What's up, what are you doing? I just started a new office job. Oh, really? I'm, yeah, I, since YouTube hasn't come back yet, I'm just gonna... <laughs> He had his YouTube channel deleted for some reason. Don't worry though, they're trying to get it back. But dude, we're out in this creek. You know where we find the guns and stuff? Yeah. I found another sick. murder weapon. You want to see? No. Check it out. <laughs> <laughs> what is, hey, what is up with us and finding tools lately? I know, right? I've, I've actually found a lot today as well. But we're having a good time. I wish you were That's out here. Good. That's good. I'm, I'm coming down. I was trying to get a plan for Florida, so. All right. We're teaming up to go to Jenny Springs for Memorial Day weekend. That's coming up. And it's actually going to be uh, this Friday through Sunday. So if you guys want to come, you might be able to see us. Uh, I think this video is going to go up Wednesday. So we just found something pretty gross. I'm not too sure exactly what it is. Looks like a bag of sand. Got my knife. I'm just going to cut it open to double check. You just never know. Someone could have hit something in here. Got to be careful. I'm going to dump out all the sand. All right, so. Oh, look. It's actually a bag of tools. That's pretty cool. You need a hand? That's a big glove. Oh my goodness. That's a giant man. <laughs> it's like a welder's glove. Yeah. Michelin man. Yeah, Alright. Excuse me. Throw a pair of scissors. That's a potential weapon. <laughs> Check it out. I found a big screw of some sort. I don't think I've ever really seen anything like that before. It's with you and tools nowadays. Nice. Check it out. That's a cool find. That's an old brake pad. And then I also got something else pretty cool here. Check it out. I'm not 100% sure, but I think this might be an old payphone of some sort. It has a little bell right here. Just reminding me, if you guys aren't notified on my YouTube channel, make sure you guys hit that notification button. But kind of cool fun. 
Just found a couple cool things. I got a broken scooter and then I've got a rip stick. Check that out. <laughs> oh no, the wheel's bad. I was gonna ride it. I also just found a knife. This is probably just a steak knife, but my brain screams potential murder weapon. <laughs> I'm just kidding. We actually haven't found anything that says like real deal potential murder weapon other than that maybe axe, but Let's keep walking down. It's gonna storm. I'm gonna put the camera away in the backpack before we mess up the camera. It started raining really heavy and we also got a warning on our phone that a flash flood is alerted in our area. So we gotta get out of here as fast as possible. If you look right over here, all the water's being poured out from the middle of the roads and down there is a whole bunch of water shooting out. So I have no idea how dangerous this potentially could be that we're in this canal. We could have a wall of water coming down for all I know. But I do have two other cool things to show you guys real quick. I found a dolly and I also found something pretty suspicious. I found a ski mask. <laughs> It's way too hot down here in Georgia. It was like 100 degrees yesterday to be wearing this. So I definitely think this is used in a robbery. But with that said, I hope you guys enjoyed the YouTube video. We didn't find anything super, super crazy. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you want to see more videos like this in the future, drop a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you guys are new. I'm going to put Kendall's YouTube channel in the description box below. Make sure you guys show her some love. But I'll see you guys in my next adventure. Peace out.